I love the team building exercises. I love meeting all the new people. Everybody's been really nice. We're Rock the Masters! Woohoo! I'm just really impressed with everyone because at my school, not many people are interested in science, and here I'm meeting lots of people who are just like me and have the same interests. Two steps that way. I love New York. I hope it's close. Oh. Make sure everything's. Oh, it's pretty heavy. What is this? If it's less than 5%, it's really I have seen so many ideas that are so brilliant. So it's really fun to learn about their projects and learn about them. So, what was the hypothesis you were testing? Why did you now build this? We've partnered with Broadcom now for over three years. Broadcom particularly recognizes how important the middle school age group is and how, how we can reach them and inspire them with a competition like Broadcom Masters and just how important that is to their future. These two are lemon, so you won't see them popping, but uh, these two are apple. So why do you think there's that difference? When the public came in to see our projects, it was really fun because we got to present to people who are really interested in what we do. And it just made us feel really good that something as important to us impacts other people's lives. Class of 13, you're very special. Every one of you came to us with joy and passion and excitement and a sense of collegiality that has made us proud from the minute we met you. We celebrate your night tonight. We think you're wonderful. We're excited about what you're going to do in the world. And we congratulate you for all you are and all that you will be. We're Black Law Masters! What type of engineers would make it possible? Software. Software, Software engineers. Purple it. Get some this culture in there and there and there. Water, so this is like a not. bunch of reasons. And I'm not double track, so. Are we done with background? One man can't possibly do the whole project in one hour. Teamwork is how you do all that and still end up feeling like everybody wins. We had to put the switch right, right here. And do exactly the same thing we did. And we want to see what year it is. See, look. Okay. You, you, you want to add this so that... This is a palm, this is a row. But this is facing the back. It's a little bit more difficult than yesterday because the challenge involves a lot more ideas, but I think it's really kind of cool because everyone has a lot of good ideas. But we're the new future of scientists, and everyone in this room is probably going to be a major player in some field of science or engineering. The amount of learning and enthusiasm that Broadcom shows is incredible, and they really help inspire young scientists like me. Hey, you guys excited to meet the president? Yes, That's going to be cool. Maybe we should um, change that number temporarily. You guys are among the brightest kids in your generation, and I hope that this enables you to go even further uh, by igniting those passions uh, to carry forward as you go on to high school and on to college. Everything I have is due to my education in electrical engineering. So, to me, giving back to STEM so that kids can see the benefit of pursuing STEM careers, it's, it's really an honor and a privilege for me to be able to do that. I went into the whole science fair thing hoping for a little participation award. I never thought I'd get this far and it's really an honor to be here. This is amazing. Everyone here is a fantastic scientist or engineer and I can't believe I got this. I just. I'm amazed and I think that it could have gone to anyone and really everyone deserved this so I'm actually a little upset that not everyone could get this honor.